Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's your man Destroy Ninja here with another update on what we've been doing on Skull and Bones. So, we've been farming this nighttime ghost pirate ship that we found. It spawns off a certain quest line. What's it called? Oceans Apart. Oceans Apart. So you pick it up from this girl right on this island here. Okay, she's just right of spawn. Then it sets up a little beacon for you to go to, just to the right of that island. So make sure you've got the quest. Because we found without the quest you don't actually get anything except for if the rule for killing the ship. So you can still kill it, you still get a little something, you just don't get the major accessory. So what we've actually been farming from the ship are things like the sail, the hull of the ship. We've been getting um, a pattern for the sail as well as uh, a new flamethrower for the front of the ship that actually looks like the one on the Mangalon. So to get that, um, as you'll see in this video, um, later on we actually board the ship so when you get it really low you can there's a small window of opportunity where you can actually throw a hook onto the ship when you hook the ship and bring it in that's when you actually get the loot so just keep that in mind um, as you're farming it you want ideally out of like 10 times you hit it or whatever over the next couple weeks because um, it spawns once every day so you can't go back and do it over and over again you can farm as I said the ethereal red parts that it drops which are uh, in-game currency which you can buy things from a store with later um, however the main things that you're probably going to want off this ghost ship are from the quest so you know it actually drops like this glowing sail that you see my friend and I have at the moment so we've been farming it and that's why I thought I'd put it up so everyone else can get the opportunity to get in and start farming this ghost ship so I hope you appreciate this content throw up a big sub and that let us know what you think in the comments. If you've got any questions about this island or you're having any more difficulties after you've seen this video on actually finding this ghost ship, please let us know because, I mean, I was having a few problems at the start too, but once I got into the rhythm of it, it took me about four or five days of playing this game to realise how it actually works. So, you know, when you work it out that it spawns daily, I sort of log in daily, hit this, and a couple of other events that I'll show you on the channel. So as long as you, you, you are subscribed up, you won't miss any of the content. Okay, we're going to go live after this actual video here and do another one where we go and farm the ghost ship again and do a couple other quests as well. So you are welcome to tune in. Um, this is where we kill the Mangaline, Mangadine there, it's called I think, and get the blue speck to flamethrower off it. So my friend actually boarded it, and all three of us I believe in the party got the blue spectre. So that's sick, we we're pretty happy with that. That's where I get the jacket that you can wear for your pirate. That glows at night time too on the back, it's sick as. Okay, so if you've got any questions let us know. Till next time, your man Destroy a Ninja, signing out.